what's good with y'all bro 2k finally dropped nba 2k 23 y'all and i'm about to show y'all the best nba 2k 23 guard build y'all let's get straight to it y'all all right so obviously look i'm gonna go with six four for this build because listen guys you guys don't want to be literally too small that 510 that 57 guard meta is not the way this year okay so look don't go that small you want to go six four so you can play some defense and still be able to be very fast as you guys can see you guys will still have a 94 potential speed now look for the wingspan you guys want to go at least three ticks up you're still going to have an 89 or really a 90 to, to be exact because you guys are still going to have a long wingspan you guys can play defense you can shoot and still be good at the game so that's what you guys want to go it doesn't really matter what you're going to pick but we're going to pick the fine so look right here look we're going to go with shooting hold on let me just figure this out for y'all real quick i got y'all right now okay this is what we're going to do okay got y'all right here boom all right ball handle uh we don't really need a 95 this year just go with a 90 at least you know what i'm saying you don't need to max that out for no reason and then we're just gonna go with an 85 pass accuracy it's not really that important and then right here we're gonna make sure our speed and acceleration is max that's like you know what i'm saying we're gonna make sure those everything's right there is good so look right here this is probably what i would say is the best guard build you know what i'm saying if you guys are strictly trying to shoot and have the most playmaking badges let's be honest you guys are not going to be playing defense this year y'all already know the meta guard lock you really don't need a lot of defensive badges um you already have a 70 perimeter defense and if needed low key to be honest with y'all if y'all really just didn't want a high speed right say you guys didn't want to have, have a have a um matter of fact speed with ball Ooh, actually hold on hold on let's bring free throw down a little bit we don't really need our free throw that high you know what i'm saying let's bring that down a little bit let's go with 60. i think our speed with ball really needs to be high so hold on let's bring that back to at least an 85 right there okay there we go and then we'll have an 85 three yeah there we go there we go this is what we're gonna do yeah and then with we'll boost y'all be fine yeah so we're gonna go with this at 85 three a 91 mid-range and a 75 driving dunk this is gonna be as y'all can see i have 26 shooting 24 playmaking and then look your defensive badges are literally enough you guys are not gonna be the on ball defender so you guys are gonna be perfectly fine so look hold on let's just max this out all right so look this is what the stats would be seven finishing 26 shooting 24 playmaking and six defensive badges at six four and you guys don't even have a low wingspan so look we're gonna obviously pick sharp take and then playmaker take as the second thing and then look as y'all can see this is to see what build we make you guys have created the shot creator at 6'4". You guys have three ticks above max wingspan. And honestly, you guys can lower the wingspan if you guys wanted a higher three, but I'm prioritizing defense so you're not a liability. So this is why I think this is the best guard build in NBA 2K23, y'all. I'm out though, y'all. Hopefully, y'all enjoyed this banger, y'all. Let's go. Oh yeah, so real quick, y'all, I just wanted to show y'all the badges, you know what I'm saying, what I would use, you know what I'm saying, obviously. So look, you guys have seven, right? You Since you guys are gonna be in the paint, you guys wanna at least have this badge on silver or gold, but I just wanted to get pro touch, so you know what I'm saying, this is what I would use, and then probably put silly finisher, so when you do get contested in the paint, you'll still be good. So look, for shooting badges, okay, so obviously we already know the real, y'all. We already know the real, come on, let's not do anything crazy, you know what I'm saying, we already know the real. So I'm hearing MIDI Magician is actually a really good badge, so make sure y'all have this at least on of fame obviously you guys want to have amped if you guys do not know and when you guys do are you know running out of stamina running out of adrenaline boost amp literally gives you a boost to making those shots so make sure you guys have this on hall of fame and then look dead eye you obviously want dead eye on silver limitless range on silver even if it's on silver you're still being going to be perfectly fine on still making those shots and then you obviously want blinders on gold and then look for me green machine is important y'all y'all can probably switch this around if you guys want it but i feel like if you're really good at shooting you don't need green machine on hall of fame or gold just keep that on silver so you get all the other badges and then for this one uh depending on what y'all do you probably want to put this on hold on guard up guard up's a good badge as well so look for playmaking you know what i'm saying we already know the real we already know the real y'all come on angle breaker and then when people use this clamps you guys want to have this badge on so you guys can still break people hands for days is on silver which is fine though because you'll still be you know you still have a good enough speed you guys want quick first step on hall of fame and then after that you guys you know what i'm saying y'all can really do what y'all want but if you guys know the takeover how to get takeover fast you guys want to have special delivery on hall of fame if you can but we're going to have it on gold for this video so look <laughs> for defense i mean like i said it doesn't really matter just have clans pick dodger you guys are not going to be the on ball defender but if you guys still have these badges you're still going to be fine so hold on all right so look these are the badges that i would go with for this build yo listen y'all this is the end of the video hopefully y'all enjoy this one and i'm finna drop a center one in a second y'all so i'm out though let's go